is in here. Checkers or what? Yeah. Julie's thinking. I can see the green flag. Number one, he sure likes to get things done with a knickknack that he went and give the cub a chore. This he'll do and ask for more. This young cub, number two, he'll do odd jobs just for you with a knickknack that he went and give a cub a chore. This he'll do and ask for more. This young cub, number three, full of humor, full of glee, with a knick-knack, patty-whack, give a cub a chore. This he'll do and ask for more. This young cub, number four, follows rules and no, no, this score. can't be this young cub. Oh, okay, let's go on. With a knick-knack, patty-whack, give a cub a chore. This he'll do and ask for more. This young cub, number five, he has courage, he has drive with a knick-knack, patty whack, give a cub a chore. This he'll do and ask for more. This young cub, number six, he'll make things with ropes and sticks with a knick-knack, patty whack, give a cub a chore. This he'll do and ask for more. This young cub, number seven, becomes a boy scout at eleven with a knick-knack, patty-whack, give a cub a chore. This he'll do and ask for more. This young cub, number eight, becomes good will and sure does rate with a knick-knack, patty-whack, give a cub a chore. This he'll do and ask for more. Good job, guys. Thank you. Okay, we uh, would like to thank Roger Barsley for the music. Um, we've got some introductions to make. I'd like to introduce myself. I'm Greg Sangster. I'm the new Cubmaster. Um, we've got uh, we've got Alan Sangster. Will you stand up? He's new. And we've got is James Murphy here? James Murphy is new. So we'd like to welcome all of you. Okay. Um, now we've got some awards. Okay, could Ty's parents come up? 
Your grandma's here. Okay, Ty is going to receive the Klondike segment that says that he went to Klondike. Um, he's also got his citizenship pin. He's got uh, his segment 17, which is the woodworking one. And he's got segment, it's not here, 94. He doesn't have 94. Okay, 94 is the Christmas caroling one. Okay. Why don't you tell us a little bit about what you did for the woodworking one, Ty? Mitch's dad shop and we made covered um, shelf Christmas. Okay. <clears throat> Why don't we get those to you? And let's give Ty a round of applause. He's got the, the woodworking segment, the segment 94, Christmas. Christmas, and his citizenship. Brett, why don't you tell us a little bit about what you did for your citizenship? We um, wrote down what, um, how the Star Spangled Banner um, came and... Did you go anywhere? Uh, yeah, last night to court. See my dad. See your dad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he was. He had to go to court. He posted a lot. And Brett also has a scarf change. I'm sure. Mom and dad take care of that. This is kind of ironic because this. He joined. So he just does started. Does he have a scarf change? He hasn't got a uniform yet. We just oh. barely got him going. Okay, well we'll give that to you, and we'll give you a round of applause. least we have Trapper and Trapper's got his citizenship in and his mom come up here. Doesn't have scar change. Okay. Why don't you tell us what you did for the citizenship? I was part of it. Please tell me we did for the service. Oh, well, we um, cleaned all the toys. <laughs> the toys <laughs> where? The nursery. The nursery. And we cleaned all the junk outside. Oh, yeah, we picked up all the garbage outside. Very good. Okay. Thank you. 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 Thank how, why, were, why they were good citizens. Okay. okay. <laughs> he received his Klondike badge and the Christmas wreath badge and the woodwork. Why don't you tell us, Patrick, uh, something about what did you make when you went to the woodwork? We all made shelves. You all made a what? A shell. A shell. And, and your mom and dad have that up in the house. <laughs> okay. okay, let's give him a round. Spencer. He has Spencer's um, mom and dad come up here. You went caroling. caroling. Very good. All right. We'll give that to you. And let's give him a little of applause. Caleb is not here. Caleb is not here. Caleb is not here. Caleb is not here. This other badge, which is, is, uh, what's it? Dinner. Dinner. Okay. Why don't you tell us what you did for that? Oh, I was dinner for a week. You did what? I was a dinner. Oh, you were dinner. Okay. <laughs> um, what, 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 what did you do? Um, 
Tell us a few things. What do you do? That's good. Let's give you a round of applause. And Alan. Let's have Alan's mother come up here. Alan got his bear, he's getting his bear badge. And he's got his uh, Faith in God Award. And Linda, why don't you tell us what the, something about the Faith in God Award? The Faith in God Award is, is a religious award that you earn through whatever religion you have. It usually has some requirements that they earn, but this is a, uh, it's an actual little medal that they earn, but this is the, the uh, emblem that's put on their scout uniform. And this emblem can be put on their Boy Scout uniform and even transferred uh, as an adult wear that on his uniform, so that's a pretty special thing. Okay, and Alan, why don't you tell us some of the things you did to earn your bear badge? Well, mostly, we had to, I had to do some um, different chapters, and probably the funnest one, I think, was the one where Mom and I got to go to the um, uh, front beach. And look for traps. And you look for traps. At the one mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Let's give him a round. Uh, we have some other ones here, but I guess we'll give those to some spellers later. Mm -hmm. Mention that the the re Back there, $15, gonna quit me there, $15 now, $15 now, $16, oh, $16 and $17 now, $17 and $18, would you $18, at $18 and $19, give me $19 now, $20, I want $20, would you be at $20, uh, $20 now, $20, just thinking, there we go, $20 now, $1. <laughs> If everyone would go outside, except the seven boys who are participating. Okay. Charlie can go out also. I'll I'm sorry. I'll to the TV. There's a TV out here by the ice skating rink. Roger. 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 Okay. Okay, tonight we're here to honor uh, two Nibelos who have completed all the requirements for their Arrow of Light Award. That is uh, Cub Scouting's highest award. So could I have uh, these two Weeblos and their parents come up here, uh, Tanner Mullen and Charlie Large. We also have a special visitor that came just for this uh, ceremony from a long ways away. His name is Chief Smiles a lot. Let's give him a round of applause. Many moons ago, these braves joined the Weeblo tribe to enjoy the fun and the advancement achieve, achievements of the Cub Scout Trail. Along the way, Tanner and Charlie have completed the five ranks of Cub Scouting. Uh, Bobcat, Wolf, Bear, Weeblo, and now they are about to receive the Arrow of Life and, and graduate into Scouting. There are seven candles here tonight that represent the ray in the Arrow of Life. As they are lit, lit, lighted, 
you will hear how they stand for the seven great virtues of life. life. Wisdom does not necessarily mean superior knowledge. It sometimes means sometimes means using knowledge using knowledge right. Courage. Courage is not the quality that enables men to meet danger without fear. It is being able to meet danger in spite of one's fear. Self-control. Self-control isn't limited to the control of one's temper, but control of oneself in all things, eating, playing, and even working and talking. Justice is the practice of doing fairly well, fairly with others without purchase or regard to race, color, or breed. Faith is the conviction that something unproved by physical evidence is true. One eight-year-old Cub Scout said faith was when you turn the light switch, you knew the light would turn would go on. Hope. Hope means to expect with confidence. Always hope for better things to come. A man without hope is far little good to himself or his community. Love. There are many kinds of love. Love of family, love of home, love of fellow man, love of God, love of community, all these loves are necessar necessary for a full life. If you live by these, by the seven great virtues, you will become a happy man, and a happy man is a successful man. It is now my pleasure to present you and your parents with the Arrow of Light Award. At this time, Tanner, you're... Let's see, at this time, Tanner and your parents, and Charlie, there's yours, and there's one for Grandma. <coughs> Now two arrows will be pre will be sent forth into the oh excuse me back one what did I do okay okay it says uh, this time Tanner your parents and Charlie your grandparents would like to present you with your own arrow to commemorate this occasion. Now, two arrows will be sent forth into the sky to, in honor of this occasion. Charlie and, and Tanner, just as you have sought and achieved the highest award in Cubs, you are now to go forth and seek these arrows, and in the years to come, you are to go forth into the world of scouting, seeking the highest, the rank of Eagle Scout. You mean this arrow or? No, I'm not. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well. I don't know if it is or not. Don't you? Which way are they going? Uh oh. Don't go over the fence. 
It's like this your ball, is isn't it? Yours, hang on. That one hurt. This has a point on it. This one's for real. Peggy's shooting this one. How do we have to get them? Now, if you wanted to do some real danger, you know, you need to count.